I'ma get the money, rack it up. I'ma get the money, stack it up, baby. Hey guys, it's Danny, and welcome to or welcome back to my channel. If you are new, make sure to subscribe, and if you're not new, welcome back. So before we get started with today's video. Um, please make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and turn my bell to my post notifications on so you can get notified every time I post a new video. Also, make sure to follow my social medias. They'll be on the screen right here as well as in the description box below. So go check that out. Um, so today's video is going to be my shoe collection. I don't have that many shoes, but I have enough to want to show them in a video so that being said let's get started with the video so the first shoes that I'm gonna show you I'll put the name on the screen I forgot the exact color name that they're called but um, I got them fun fact I got them from Plato's closet for $55 on Black Friday and I thought they were a really good deal and they're my first pair of dunks they are a little bit creased but I'm not really worried about it Okay, so like I was saying, they are a little bit creased, but I'm not worried about it because it's nothing that I can't fix. Um, but they are so cute, and they are right here. They are the Dunk Lows, and they're in a size um, 5 Youth, which is what I wear. Um, like I said, they are a little bit creased, but not by me. So, I'm fine with that. Um, but I will put the exact color combo on the screen, probably like right here of what they exactly are but they are one of my favorite shoes and i love them so much so i got those um next i don't know exactly what these are um nobody has been able to tell me exactly what they are if they're four five six i don't know but uh i do have these um right here and i will show an up close of them so you can see a little bit better but i just have no idea what these are they were one of my first pairs of Jordans, and yeah, so they have like a horseshoe on this one, and then on the back of this one right here is like a four, so I don't know what they are, but if someone wants to let me know in the comments, please do. Um, so then I have all of my shoes next to me and they're in their boxes, so I'm just going to go from top to bottom. Probably Jordan's first, just because they're right next to me. So, like I said, I do wear a five and a half youth. So the next shoe I'm going to show you is the Air Jordan One Mid Edge Glow, and they're grade school, obviously. So um, these are like my prized possessions. These were like two hundred dollars when I got them last year. Uh, my prized possessions, like I said, a lot of people have their opinion about mids. Um, mids, I don't have an opinion on. I love all Jordans and A Ones, so. If I like it, I like it. If I don't, I don't. But I'm not going to just not like a shoe because it's a mid. Like, I love these. A lot of people also have an opinion about the six specific shoe. But I love them so much. Here they are. They are the white with, like, the, like, bright colors. And I don't know what sold me about the shoe was, like, the look from the front. I absolutely loved them when I got them. And I still love them, and I don't wear them much. Uh, they're a little bit dirty because I did wear them for a photo shoot. But, love these so much, so, so much. And I always keep crease protectors, even though they don't really help much, but they're still there in case. But, um, I love these, so. I got those babies. And then, next are blazers. So, next are the... Uh, women's blazer mid 77LX. Um, these blazers are from StockX. They are the ones with the gold chain. Uh, I don't have blazers. These are my first pair of blazers. Um, and again, I'll show an up close version of all of these shoes. But these blazers are so freaking hard to put on. I'm not even going to lie with you. Like, so hard to put on. It literally took me. I had to take them off to try on some Air Force Ones. That my brother got me. You'll see later in this video. Um, and it took me, like, 30 minutes to get them back on. With help from my brother's girlfriend. So, you know, they're really hard to get back on. But it's probably because they're brand new. But I absolutely love these so, so much. Again, I'm blessed to have these. The next shoe is the Jordan Flight Club 91 GG. 
I do not like these. Um, first of all, flights. A lot of people have opinions about their flights, too. Uh, I don't. Like I said, if I like the shoe, I like the shoe. If I don't, I don't. I did love these when I first saw them. But then I started wearing them. They make a noise when you wear them. And you have to wear high socks. Otherwise, your skin shows. I love the color combo on these. But I do not like the shoe. As it is. Um... <clears throat> They are, like, cute, but not fun to wear, again, like I said. Um, these are a six youth, so, like, I wear anywhere between a five and a half and a six in youth, which is, like, a seven, seven and a half in women's, or five and a half, six in men's. Um, <clears throat> yeah, so, do like the color combo on these, do not like the shoe as it is. Um, my next shoe, also a fan favorite and a favorite of mine. My first ever Jordans. Um, these are the Air Jordan 12 Retros. Um, absolutely love these so much. I will never, ever, ever give these away. Give them up, sell them, nothing. These will forever be in my closet. Um, I don't know. And then about the suede, the, like, the purple magenta color. Something about this shoe just makes me happy. Like, I love these. My first pair of Jordans I had ever got were these, and I don't know. Out of all the shoes that I own, these are hands down will always be my favorite. I don't know if it's because they're my first shoe, but they're just so like pretty. I don't know, and they're very, very, very freaking comfortable. Like, and they're really hard to crease. So I'll uh, forever love these, like forever, ever. And ever. So. That's with my Jordans. Now we're going to go on to Air Forces. These are the Air Force One Shadow SE. Um, these are, again, not my favorite color lots. I do love my Air Force Ones. But, color combo. These have such a random color combination on them that I don't know if I love them or don't love them. I don't know. So many different things can go with this shoe just because there's so many different colors on it. But would it be my first shoe to go towards when buying shoes? Definitely not. I did not did not buy these by myself. That's why. But um, they are a cute shoe. They have like the glitchy look. Uh, again, you'll see in the up close. But these are the Shadow SE. And like I said, they just have like green, like blue, uh, maroon like mint green, light gray, like just random colors together and holographic. I don't know. They're cute, but definitely not something that I would buy myself. Next we have the Nike Air Max 90 LTRSE grade school again. Um, I had my mom pick these. She liked these out of all the shoes that I showed her and I bought these right before Christmas. So here they are. They are very beautiful and very pretty, and I just love, like, the pink with the navy, and I don't know, and I love, like, the khaki color with the navy and the pink as well. Um, I don't know, something about this shoe is just really pretty and simplistic and clean. It looks clean. Love these and cannot wait to wear these. We have the Nike Air Force One LV8 2 which are the Have a Nike Day Air Force Ones. Um, I got these for free for my birthday for doing a photo shoot like last year, 2020. Um, here they are. They just have like the smiley face right here. The light pink bottom. Um, they're like very hard to crease. I don't even think you can crease them. I don't know. Actually, they kind of, they kind of look creased, but they're not creased. It's just the material. And then on the tongue, it does say Have a Nike Day right there. These are very comfortable, very cute, very pink and girly, and I don't know, I just love them. I don't wear them that much, but these are like more of like a birthday party type of shoe, just because they do have a smelly face and like, I don't know, they remind me of like a birthday party and like happiness and like someplace happy is where I'll wear those. Moving on, I have the uh, Women's Air Force Ones. Uh, my brother bought me two pairs of these because they finally got them in stock. They're just the plain Air Force Ones. Um, 
These are so hard to find in store. And since they had them, my brother bought me two of them because they're so hard to find. And they're just a staple that everybody needs. And you can never get enough of these. I have two rundown pairs and now I have two new pairs. So, these are going to be my special occasions. And then the other ones I'm going to be wearing like out places. Um, because I just don't want to ruin these like I did my other ones. And these are so freaking pretty. And I just, I don't know, like, I can never get enough of A1s. So, these are a must in anybody's wardrobe, clearly. So, like I just said, my brother bought me two of them. So, here is the second one. Um, I will gladly show you guys this one as well. I'm not going to take it out, but here it is. Um, absolutely love these. Can never get enough. 10 out of 10. Recommend. The next shoe that I got is the Women's Air Force One Shadow. My brother got me these for Christmas this year. And I am beyond obsessed with these. I had never even seen these until my brother, until I opened them. And I saw them and I was like, um, this is an actual shoe. Because this color combo is not something that I would gravitate towards either. But I absolutely love it after wearing it. I don't know why. And I love the suede. I love how it says sister, has a sister pendant on the um, laces. I don't know. I just absolutely love this shoe. Here it is. Um, it has like the glossy black check mark. Um, and then this part is suede, which I love. Um, and then it has like touches of purple and like a reddy orange color and a like a goldish yellow color. And then the dark red as well. Um, I think these are very, very sleek, very, very nice, very out there, but very drippy. And like I said, it has the sister pendant right here, which is ironic because my brother did get them for me. So, sister, brother, yeah. Um, but I'm obsessed with these and I absolutely cannot get enough of these. Um, so, yeah, uh, my brother knows me very well my second favorite horses I own All right, these babies right here they actually just came in the mail this morning I ordered these on Christmas day with the money that my parents gave me and these came in like I just said this morning these are the women's air force ones oh seven the names of these I remember are the Sherpa fleece and these are so beautiful I have nothing like these at all they are like an off-white cream color with the blue tongue and then it has orange on the top of the tongue the inside of the shoe is orange and it has blue check marks and right here is fleece like a sherpa fleece you'll see it in the up close around the tongue and like around the shoe the top of the shoe is also sherpa it has like a little nike box thing right here like you don't gotta tie them because it has the little thingy right here Bro, these shoes right here make me so freaking happy. I don't know why. I think it's the fur and the color because I don't have anything like dark blue like this. And I wanted a shoe that has dark blue like this. But these right here are amazing. And I 10 out of 10 recommend these. So comfortable. So pretty. So Florida Gator but type of vibe. Which is my also favorite team football wise. So these will go very well with the Florida merch that I got. Or that I've had. Um, <clears throat> but... 10 out of 10. Recommend that shoe right there. With that being said, that is all of my shoes. Um, Air Jordan wise, or Jordan wise and Air Force One wise, like all my sneaker type of shoes. I do have Vans, like three pairs of Vans. And I do have um, Tim's, but I only wear them. I mainly wear these. So, <clears throat> without further ado, I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Also, make sure to, like I said in the beginning of the video, Comment down below any video ideas you got, as well as follow my social medias. They'll be on the screen as well as in the description box below. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and hit the bell for post notifications on so you can get notified every time I post a new video. And without further ado, I'll see you guys in my next video. I'ma get the money, rack it up. I'ma get the money, stack it up, baby.